Hi everyone, not sure if this is working because the 321 uh, came on twice then, so no idea what's going on there. So it says the particle is initially at rest. So that tells me that when t is zero, v is zero. At a point where s is free, so that tells me when t is zero, s is free. So this is important information when we find c. So this is for finding my c values. So it tells me the acceleration. So the acceleration is t cubed minus 2t squared. I want to find expressions for the velocity and the position. So in terms of the velocity, my velocity, so starting with the acceleration, to get back to the velocity, I need to integrate the acceleration. So my velocity is the integral of my acceleration dt. So the velocity is the integral of t cubed minus 2t squared dt. So it's a quarter t to the 4 minus t cubed, or sorry, 2 thirds t cubed, that's the two-thirds t cubed plus c. So the plus c is really, really important here. Now I'm told that initially it's at rest. So t is zero and v is zero. So zero is a quarter of zero to the four minus two-thirds of zero cubed plus c. So it gives me zero for c. So you might have seen that already. What it does mean then is that my velocity is a quarter t to the four minus two thirds t cubed. That's my expression for the velocity, so I've done that. Right, so now let's have a look at the position or its displacement. So that's integrate my velocity to get back to the position. So s or r or x, whatever letter you want to use, would be my velocity dt. So it's the integral of my quarter t to the 4 minus 2 thirds t cubed dt. So what have I got there? So I've add 1 to the power, divide by the new power. So 120 of t to the 5. Add 1 to the power, divide by the new power. Gives me that. Or c. Now I'm told that when t is 0, s is 3. So 3 is 1 over 20, 0 to the 5, minus 1 over 6, 0 to the 4, plus c. So you can see that c is 3 this time. There. So my expression for my um, position is s equals 1 over 20, t to the 5, minus 1 over 6, t to the 4 plus 3. There we go. So that's what we've done. There's a, a question for you. There. Let me see if I can take the thing off. So have a go at the question for you. So my velocity is integrating my acceleration, my distance, my displacement, or position, oops, is integrating my velocity. There. There we go. After you've done that, there should be some questions for us to have a go at. Right, see you later.